You ever thought to yourself that we are the AI in the simulation? I mean, we're already at the point where our video games on the Xbox, PlayStation, PC, whatever, we're already at the point where we're starting to implement AI characters into the game. AI characters that can quote, quote, think for themselves. AI characters that are starting to ask us questions. Are we their God? I mean, we created it. We created the code. We created the environment that they live in. We program into it the rules of engagement while playing said game. Wait, that almost sounds like our world when it comes to universal principles and laws. You know, law of polarity, law of correspondence, law of attraction. If you don't want to go that deep with it, let's just say you say something mean to someone, that's going to evoke a response from them. If you punch someone in the face, the rules of this program, this matrix that we are living in, is you have the right to defend yourself. In America, you walk up and you're the one that punches somebody in the face for no reason. Part of the programming says that the police come and arrest you and you go spend a certain amount of time in jail when you start to unlock a whole bunch of different other programs. You know, the programs aren't running until you enter a lot of these buildings. You see what I'm saying? So how do you know what's happening behind these closed doors? The same way how you think some of these people, they, oh, that, that's uh, that's Betty that lives in that house. Betty might not even exist. You've seen we, uh, we Clone Tyrone? He thought that was his mama in the room the entire time. Spoiler, if you didn't see a movie a year after release, that's your fault. But nevertheless, it's like, this is the type of stuff I think about on a regular basis. We're following rules, that some unseen rules, unseen doctrines, even when it's like, take away society. When we get around with one another, when men and women meet, there's like that, that primal urge to want to procreate, to carry on life. Who programmed that into us? Was it God? Or was it some, some fat neckbeard dude sitting at the computer coding us to act a certain type of way? What if we are just somebody's character? And when you're in certain metaphysical principles, they just say that this is just a meat suit. We're on Sirius X. We're in somewhere in Lemuria. We're, we're beaming ourselves from the, down in the waters of Atlantis or something like that. We're just a, a hollow vessel living our experience in this ether, in this level, in this dimension, if you will. You know, once again, I'm just thinking out loud, but it, hopefully I didn't screw up some of y'all's days, but it's just something to think about. Let me know what you think to the next one.